Hello everybody, I'm Heather Knox, Chief Executive here in NHS Lanarkshire. Uh, this is my weekly video to staff. I'll start off as I usually do with the, the COVID numbers and then I want to touch on a couple of other issues uh, that I want to share with staff this week. So firstly, the numbers. Um, unfortunately, we've seen the COVID numbers go up again over the last um, week to 10 days to 137. So we're clearly not out of the woods with uh, this, this pandemic still continuing to be a, a huge pressure on our inpatient beds. Only three patients in ICU, which is, is comparatively good news. Um, however, ICU has been busy with other patients. Um, 32 outbreaks in care homes, which is a cause for concern. That's again up significantly since this time last week. And it does make us ask questions about whether or not the vaccine uh, efficacy is now waning a bit amongst our, our older residents. Um, and that's being looked at nationally through public health colleagues. And vaccination delivery, 413,000 now uh, delivered across NHS Lanarkshire. We've seen this week the launch of the, the consultation on the planning proposals for the new hospital, which is very exciting for us. And it's great to see that moving forward. The site is lovely. I'm going out to the site again on Monday and it really is a lovely site. It's very green with lots of space um, and it's a hugely exciting project for us. So looking really forward to seeing that move ahead. We've also seen this week some media coverage from staff who have spoken to the media about the ongoing pressures. And I think that's really important because at times it can feel like we're in a wee bit of a bubble uh, within the NHS because uh, the world around us, lots of people are very keen to get back to what they see as, as normal. And obviously we are not in a normal situation. So I think it is good to be able to share that. So thank you to those staff who contributed to those media pieces. It's all really helpful to promote understanding. And that understanding, again, I hope will create more tolerance uh, amongst the public. And um, we have had some issues, as you know, over recent weeks and months uh, with violence and aggression. And that isn't something that we stand up for at all. So um, it's really important that when staff experience this, that they do date their concerns and they will be looked into and you will get support for doing that. So just wanted to put that message across again today um, and we'll keep working on the training support we can give to staff as well and also signposting people to the wellbeing options. And I'm sorry that some of you have had to experience violence and aggression during this difficult period. Thank you again for listening to me.